The legend of the princess is thus. Long ago, there was a princess who ruled over the world of Ioria. She was the daughter of Gaia, the queen of all, who had complete and utter control over everything. Her daughter had powers as well, not unlike that of the other gods, which allowed her to build towering structures and sculpt the land to her will and do as she pleased. The princess was very kind and lived on the earth amongst the rest of the mortals. On one horrible day, the princess suddenly vanished without a trace, leaving both Gaia and the other gods distraught and the mortals confused and scared. No one knew where she had disappeared to or when she would return. It was also said that she kept much of her magic inside a scepter of power, which the gods broke into three pieces and scattered across the land with a curse, so that no one except the princess would be able to recraft them together without being killed, and so that if the princess was to ever return, her power could be fully restored. Many hundreds of years passed, and it was unknown if she would ever return, and the gods grew silent, but whispers carried on the winds spoke of the return of the princess. When all of the information was gathered from the rumors, a prophecy revealed itself. Long ago the princess lived, amongst the mortals she did give, boons to them yet one day passed. The princess gone, the gods aghast. She'd return, however, in a different form. No memory of the life she'd worn, and on her bod clothed she'd be, in a colored garment with purple and green. And if she crafted the scepter whole, her memory returned of gods of old. The princess of Iora would live amongst the mortals once again. For many hundreds of years more, the princess would stay again. Adored. Oh, what the fuck? Mm -hmm. Huh? The chat. What did it say? I missed it. Open it up. Hang on. It's it's asking me about the resource pack. Yeah, just click yeah. Uh, I did. So you just press T. So oh, hi, what? welcome. I don't know. Maybe it's a one one nine feature or something. Mine says. Mine says, welcome once again, princess, to the world of Aoria. Mine didn't say anything, it just said, uh, John Slot joined the game. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Can you see that, though? I can see it, yeah. It's like, it's purple and italicized. Of course, yeah. it's kind of like a purple It's a fuchsia. Thing. That's fuchsia. Fuchsia. Oh, it's fuchsia. Oh, my goodness. Well, look at my outfit. My outfit is the same color. Is it? Is your outfit? I guess they're kind of the same color. Well, parts of it. It kind of, yeah. Like, by my wrists. Not my boots. Hello, I'm Jumpsplat120, and this is an unnamed, as of yet, Minecraft series. Basically, it's just vanilla Minecraft. You guys might be asking, why are you playing vanilla Minecraft? You're kind of you're kind of known for modded Minecraft. You're known for making mod packs, blah blah blah. And yeah, I do like to do modded Minecraft, but I always do modded Minecraft, even when I'm not playing. Um, when I'm not recording, I'm doing modded Minecraft. And I don't think I've ever played via vanilla. I don't think I've ever gone all the way to the end. I don't think I've ever done any of that sort of stuff. I've always just done it modded and you know summoning the wither is not hard when you can set up an uh a, you know an mfr farm in auto farm wither skeletons you know now, killing the ender dragon is not easy when you have tinker construct that's all but doing it vanilla i've never done it vanilla so i think that'd be really interesting to try to uh do that and to help me on that journey we have 
We can hear you, by the way. I, I hope you know. Oh, where the fuck did you go? Oh. <laughs> we, uh, we can hear while I'm speaking if I get a little bit too loud. Uh, well, not that time. Um, the, we can hear me through your headphones, through your speakers. Oh, okay, and, give me a second. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Just turn your, your headphones down a little bit. Yeah, I did. It's fine. Okay. Um, These headphones are really, really good about projecting noise, even if it's not supposed to happen. Yeah. So yeah, vanilla Minecraft. You ready to get started? Sure. And what do you do in every vanilla ser uh, vanilla series? Punch a tree. Punch a tree. Get bitches. I mean, get what? Sorry. <laughs> get bitches. I don't well, know. Well, same my head. diff. Same diff. Yeah. Basically the same thing. Your your head is in the gutter. It's not the only place my head is. Whoa! Oh! Uh, um, now I'm gonna sit. Uh, we're, we're, let's basically let's let's pretend that we have no idea where we are. Oh, where should we set up our I house? Still, honestly, I uh, honestly don't know. You where don't, we're... do you? Fucking a. Nope. We were <laughs> we tried playing it earlier, and I re we recorded oh, like at least an hour of footage, like three episodes, two episodes depending on how I edited it, uh, and <laughs> apparently none of the game audio or Kendra's audio got recorded, so I was just sitting there talking to myself like a lunatic, uh, but what we had decided was we were going to set- Responding to things that Yeah, responding to things that weren't there. What we had decided was we were going to set up on top of this house, or sorry, we were going to set our house <laughs> on top of this hill, because uh, it's a nice hill you can kind of see out on the plains, um, you know, we have the forest right next to us, all oh, that's- lovely stuff. Um, so I figure it, we'll just basically do the same thing, but this time let's try not to fuck up as badly as we did the first time, which nobody knows. Never <laughs> happened. I mean, we didn't fuck up. What am I talking about? It was actually a fantastic, fantastic first go. Such a bummer that we didn't get it recorded. Like, we anymore. had all the food Who we needed. Who knew that you could beat the Ender the Dragon so quickly? See, so here I am worrying about food and chickens. <laughs> Who knew? I mean, God, and you, the way you summoned the wither and we were, like, fighting it, oh my God, that was intense shit. My chicken even helped. I know, he was, and like, the chickens, out I the didn't eyes. even realize chickens could do that, but oh my God, it was crazy. Yeah, it's a bummer that first episode didn't get recorded, though. Lots of cool shit we missed. <laughs> All right, where'd it, where it is? Where, where, where it is? Where be? Yo, where to be? Where to, Where you be? Where you be at? Oh, I'm on top of the fucking hill, baby. Where you at? What? It's like north, I think. What fucking hill? There's so many fucking There's hills. There's like one hill. Is this north? Facing south. East? North. It's south. Useless. It's south from spawn. But it's basically a... <sighs> basically a negative a thousand thousand. I'm on top of a hill and you're not here. Oh my god. I can't see you. Where the fuck are you? Go to negative one thousand... Negative one thousand. Hang on, I'll just wander around. I'll find you eventually. No, you're just gonna, like, wander farther and farther. Okay, just... Where are you, love? What, what are your coordinates? Do I have to come get you? Uh, there are a bunch of red flowers. Oh, but what are your coordinates? <laughs> <laughs> I see flowers and grass. What button do I use for that? F3. I don't remember anymore. F3? I just thought uh. it was F3. I, yeah, I was just... <laughs> 1, 000, 1, 000. About 1,000. It's 1,070, 1,070. <laughs> I was so bad at this. I clearly... <laughs> no, I mean, like, coordinates. King. Well, it's, it is south, so... South of spawn, but south of anywhere. I highly doubt you managed to pass me. I would have seen it. It's like a big open field. If you had gone that far south, I think I would have seen you. There you are. Did you see me? Yep, you're punching a tree. Yes, I am. And being punched by me. Hi. Hi. Alright. Thank you. Let's see if we can... I like how last time we went for oak wood and this time it's all birch. I mean, I already had birch. I was working with it. I was thinking maybe we could just literally repeat the exact same design, but then I would have to chop down all birch and 
was like, what the fuck would I do with all the, or I have to chop down all oak, and then what would I do with all the birch I just had, you know? Right. We just need a little... I think I'm gonna design this little cave to be a little better than last time. Because it was just... We need to hurry up. I, I know. Last time it was such a clusterfuck, you just kind of came down here and swam in the water and shit. Mm. It's just obnoxious. Yep. There was no easy way to get out. I'm obnoxious. I'm obnoxious. There we go. If possible, I'd like to just completely fill it in. That way we'd... I don't think you're in the same cave. What? It is the same exact cave. It's like the one that's like 10 feet away from our house. That's the one we were using oh, last time. Oh, that one. Okay, I'm one further down. Yeah, this is the one we were using last time. A frower. That's racist. A frower. A frower. Shit. I didn't actually make a pick. I kind you I kind of forgot how the progression of Minecraft worked. I'll be honest. Oh. Oh, I used my last eight pieces of wood to make a fucking chest. Ah. Uh, I am pretty useless. Well, the creepy crawlies are about to come out and kill us all, so that'll be fun. Do you remember how to get home? Are you serious? I'm like two feet away from it. Are you though? I am though. Are you talking, nah. are you talking about the cave or the house that hasn't been built? cave. Okay, I'm also two feet away from that. Boom, progression. Look at it, look at me flying through the progression of Minecraft. It's so good, it's so complicated. What, are you serious? <laughs> You're not even in here. Where the fuck are you? Yes, I am. You piece of shit. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Are you Where? just tunneling under the ground? I'm right behind you, by yeah. the way. I know. Okay. I thought you were tunneling towards me. Or trying no. to. No. Oh shit, water. Oh, why? I'm sorry. Why not just tunnel with me under the ground? Under the sea. But like, mostly under, under the ground. Under the sea, under the sea. We need, we need to get sea. deep. As deep as we can possibly get, so we can get I'm all, a little room. all them sweet diamond loots. And then we can enchant them. And Just then this, diamonds, we don't give a shit about anything can, else. This series can be over as soon as possible, because god, I hate vanilla Minecraft. Hate it, hate it with the passion. Same. Sorry, I'll just have to cut that part out. <laughs> you can leave my same, and I'll be like, same. wonder what he said. Um, no, I don't mind vanilla Minecraft. But there are, there are things that I just feel like it's a little empty sometimes, you know? A little slow and boring. Yeah, it's a little slow. There are a lot of big gaps between Because the progression is linear. I like exponential progression. Um, for example, when you're playing WoW, even though the monsters aren't getting any easier, the amount of damage you're dealing is increasing exponentially, you know? And the amount of gold that... <clears throat> No, 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 it's not a nerd thing. It's like a, it's a math thing. Um, and it's, it's a human psychology thing. When you're, when you're playing Jesus Christ is Dark, can I, like, increase my brightness? There we go. It's way better. Jesus. Working in the pitch black. Oh, are you serious? I can't believe you done that. No. <laughs> Have you seen that video? Uh-uh. Oh my god, it's so funny. This guy's talking, I don't know what he's about to say. And he's he's like, okay, so I was thinking, and he gets punched by his friend, and he just goes, Oh no! I can't believe you've done that. <laughs> it's You know what's really funny is that my friends uh, that I met at the Dude Ranch, they were British and they live in London. Well, um, they live in and Colorado, so it's like we would... don't they? They don't live in London. Oh my god, stop. And <laughs> Ah, would, what um, the fuck did you leave like open windows for? Him? What was the point of that? I didn't have enough dirt. 
Here. Why? Don't. I'm no, so I do close now. to dead. Good. Be dead. Wow. I have a shovel. If it comes down to it, I think I I'll have, beat you out. I have meat. Oh. oh. Put some meat in your mouth. Actually, oh shit. You know what? Let me make another crafting table. I can make a furnace and cook the meat. It's just lamb. That's me. I have like just enough wood, I think, to cook some of this. Cool. Jump spies are in the cheese. Hot topic. What are you doing? Waiting. There's nothing to do at night. I don't have an axe. I don't have a pick. You can always yellow have... it. Neat. No, I'm so bad at yellowing. I panic. Oh, no. Yo, 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 yo. Here. You can continue our, <gasps> our descent into. Uh, but I'm scared of the dark. I know. Have fun! Thanks. If I had some armor, I'd go out there, but. It's just not. Not worth it. You know what we could do is we could make this like a double wide staircase. Okay. I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna start on the like the double wide section. Okay. I'll make it just a, a little bit more bearable going up and down. Yeah, right. Although when it becomes daytime, how will we know? How, Magic. How will we know? That's one trick that I never use in um, modded Minecraft because I tend to play modded Minecraft way more yellowy than I play vanilla. Uh, but in modded Minecraft, mm -hmm. if you have NEI or JEI, you can just type in the um, you can just type in clock, and it'll show you a, a clock. But the thing is that the clock functions, so you can actually see what time it is without ever having to actually craft one. That's cool. It's incredibly cheaty. It like totally defeats the purpose of this <laughs> one use item. Like clocks have no other purpose, and you don't even need to craft one if you're playing modded Minecraft. Wah, it, and the wah. thing is, like by the time you get that far into the game that you're spending gold on clocks, you don't need to make a clock generally. Like you have, you have like a right. skylight that goes all the way down into your mine, or you have like complicated like daylight sensors set up and all daylight this other sensors yeah. well it's like for example with etho he had like an alarm clock thing so when the sun went down it would sing like a good night song yeah and then when the um, sun came up it would sing like a good morning song and he hooked it up to a bunch of note blocks i mean maybe not quite that complicated but that's the, it was so cool that is the right idea well, it was when yeah. he lived underground yeah and you just don't need you just don't need a clock is the thing i feel he like i'm mining way faster than you somehow really funny because I can't see, and I have to keep stopping to make sure that I'm turn, mapping it turn, properly. Turn your brightness up. I did, it's all the way up. Oh, it's all the way up? Turn your brightness I've up I've always on your had screen. difficulties with this. I'll show you how to do that at some point, but not now. But your screen's probably just too dark. Oh, water. Ugh, you've ruined everything. Ah, oh, there but it goes. I found coal. It broke right as I got down there. <clears throat> There's a little bit of iron up here too, which is nice. Iron. Iron. 